I'm still here. I got super quiet. Like super, well, super I quiet. Just, I just said it should be in. God damn it. Is like that. Yeah. Okay then. Well, that means I'm gonna have to make a augmented capacity room. Requires three buckets. Stone and then slate. So I'm gonna have to make an reinforced slate. Everything got dark. Um. Hmm. It, it still says we're we're generating zero RF a tick, but is it raining? Mm. It's raining. That might have something to do with it, but I don't know. Where's the phoenix? I'll make this so much easier to figure out. Cause then I could just kind of fly up to the roof. This phoenix has been amazing, Alex. Yeah. They're running at 100% efficiency. They each have 250,000 RF stored in them. Each. And all the cables are probably also full. They should be full. Mm-hmm. They are connected. Yep, they're all connected. I don't think the painter is connected, actually. The painter doesn't get connected. That is so weird. The painter isn't connected. Okay. Hmm. Stupid zombies. I guess let me I connect just, the painter. You know what? I just came up with a good idea. Which is? I'm going to take all of these uh, compartments and all that that I had up here for use, and I'm going to sink them one level into the ground. That way the mobs will just run right over them. That would be an idea. That way I won't have to worry about wasting anymore. Yeah. That is an idea. Oh, that is not the right inventory. So, where to go from here? Uh, a magical land. I'm thinking about starting on Draconic Evolution items right now. Well, you fall of shit, Charlie. Why is that? I don't know. I'm pretty sure we have to go to the end first. Yeah. Do you think we can't take on the Ender Dragon right now? I'm pretty certain we can't. <laughs> okay, should I go and make a Tinker's Construct stuff? Yeah, making Tinker's Construct shit would probably be a good idea, yeah. yeah actually, yeah, we do need to make a lot of Tinker Construct shit. Uh, so I'm pretty I mean, sure we don't have any grout. Get... Huh? Uh, yeah, you're you're spot on the money in that assumption. So I need clay for sure. Okay. So I need. I need to make grout. I am grout. Marble's totally gonna sue your ass, Charlie. Spell grout. Huh? Never mind. I am grouped. <laughs> Not you damn right they're gonna sue me. I have a spell on that right. Wow. It is literally called I am grout whenever you hover over it too. They are gonna get sued. <laughs> 
Yeah, they are. By the way, someone's here to fuck you. I hope not. I can't get a recipe for grout. Well, it's obviously... Okay, I remembered that there was clay and gravel. Yeah, clay, gravel, and sand is the recipe. But I can't get it to show me the recipe. I'm actually looking for it in any eye, and I must be blind. Yeah, probably. Okay then, this should help me do things a lot easier. By sinking everything uh, into the ground, it is basically giving me more space to work. Grout does not have a recipe. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, Estrep doesn't have one. I'm like looking at it and I'm not finding any kind of recipe. So the way we have to get it is using either an arc furnace. We can use a no, we can't use a redstone furnace. We can't. We can use stone bricks and an arc furnace to get uh, seared bricks. Pretty much. Hold on. Have you tried making it? I can't, there's not even a recipe for it. Like, hold on, Charlie. Okay, hold on, yeah, you're right. Um, let me get some clay, I guess. That didn't make shit in clay. Let's see, tankers, yeah, tankers construct grout. Grout is, uh, let me see. Gravel, sand, and a clay ball. Mm-hmm. That makes two grout. Um, what's the configuration? Uh, well... Hmm. It's literally just shapeless crafting. It just requires those three together. Like one gravel, one sand, and one clay ball? Yeah. That's how it looks, yeah. And of course we don't have any gravel in the system, so now I gotta go hunting for gravel in the system. Uh, do you got any gravel downstairs? Uh, I checked the stone chest, but we're still probably gonna be. You got some. Short supply. One gravel, one sand, and one clay ball. No, nothing. Nothing at all. The golden helmet is just expensive. Disabled, Charlie. Huh? The golden helmet is disabled. Really? Use HSLA steel arm instead. I don't even see a recipe for that either. No, here it is right here. Disabled... Yeah, they're all disabled. I mean, you can still get them. Yeah. Get them from, like, the treasure bags, which are all Thomcraft. You could get them in loot chests, I know. I'm actually surprised that's disabled. I'm probably going to go into Rotary Craft and disable the whole entire HS A Steel bullshit. Disabling. Or make it to where like things like like I can understand 
some of the items being disabled for it, but like gold helmet, that makes no sense to disable. Like what the hell? And there yep. you go, teleporting again. Yeah, I'm teleporting because, well, I got a whole bunch of shit up at that altar that I don't need, and I'm putting it up in the house. Ah. Uh. Yeah. Just a whole bunch of crap that I don't need right now. But I will need in the future. Ouch, what just hit? Just putting up some more food. How are we looking on strength? Uh, probably not decent. But not bad. Mm. Got it. Well, I got us some string out here. That's fine. Um. So I guess I need to make an arc furnace. So. Oh, look at that! A pair of robots. Well, isn't that just wonderful? the looks of that one so you could create these darker sealed bricks these brown ones and they have an EMC value huh is correct so I need an arc furnace which arc furnace is this though Is it the Galactic Craft Electric Arc Furnace? No telling. Or the Advanced Rockstry Arc Furnace? Once again. I mean, that's the only Arc Furnaces. I see there's an Arc Lamp. I guess there is also the um, Immersive Engineering Arc Furnace, I think. I can find the book, I can tell you. Hold on. Charlie, you need to stop your book reading. That's that's not good. Why is that? Book reading? Yeah. It's just not good, Charlie. Yeah, even the Mighty Smeltery book tells you the recipe for grout. Really? So, what does the Mighty Smeltery recipe say? Uh, one sand, one gravel, one clay. Hmm. Wow. Engineer's manual. There's an arc furnace, ain't there? Yeah, arc furnace. Holy shit. Expensive. <laughs> Ten steel scaffolding, seven heavy engineering blocks, which I believe all require a diamond, fourteen light, twenty-seven reinforced black blast brick, uh four blocks of steel, fourteen steel slabs. And one cauldron. Now, I'm pretty sure that's probably um, overkill. I don't think I need that one, cause the arc furnace I'm looking at in the recipe. There's no way it's a um, immersive engineering, cause immersive engineering ones don't have GUIs mm. most of the time. That's our turn to both traditional coal and electric furnaces, double output from ores. So, that requires a electric furnace, some heavy duty plating, uh, uh, 
Uh, I don't know how to get this yet. Meteor, meteoric iron. Meteoric iron. Yes, I need That's some. That's iron from meteors. Yeah, I need some of that to re refined. I need some advanced, uh, advanced wafers. Oh, advanced wafers! Now, Charlie, you're in my ballpark. Yeah, and then I need some. You're um, gonna need uh, diamonds, silicon, some repeaters, um, and you're gonna need to use the circuit making machine that is over there by my Galacticraft solar panel. Question though. Do we have Fuck. any me me meteoric iron? Oh, hell no, bitch. You're going to have to go find that yourself. <laughs> don't we have to, like, go to space to get that? Uh, I don't think so. Can we even get to space without it? Mm, probably not. See, a tier one rocket requires us to have the heavy-duty plate, which actually is not that bad. At all, actually. Charlie, we, we don't have to go to space to get meteoric iron. I know, but I feel like it'd be easier to get it from space. Charlie, all you have to do is find a Skystone uh, meteor. Really? I ain't seen a single... Well, I have seen them, but... I've seen quite a few. <laughs> you just aren't looking. I'm just fucking blind. You blind, bitch. You blind! Where is that compass? Guess I will be back with the, um... With the Phoenix. Zoom way out on the map. And maybe I've done seen something. Maybe I've done scene one and just don't realize it. Okay, so I got the buckets I need. And uh, I'll need a reinforced slate. Where is a reinforced slate? Oh fuck, I just jumped off the Phoenix! Well. That hurt. <sighs> well, I guess I'm going back out here. So, what are you working on now? I'm working on making rooms of augmented capacity. Are you? A is it actually letting you build them? Uh, I don't know yet, because I don't have the other materials to make them yet. I found something scary. What? A Minecraft squid in oil. And now I'm probably about to drown. Help. I need help. Help. What do you want me to do? I don't know. Help me. Help. Drown. Air. I need drown. air. Drown faster. It brings me amusement. There's squids in this oil pit. Oh, I died. Again. Ah, there we go. What? Get a hold of. What was it? Okay, this is the imbued slate. Now, let it, me What see. does it allow you to do again? It, shut up, Charlie. I'm just trying to make sure I get this right. I wish we could put a waypoint on our Phoenix. Of augmented capacity, okay then. So I'll need three buckets. Our Phoenix stone. is still flying downwards. There's stone. There's buckets. Where did I put my. Ah, there it is. So do you need a gold helmet for something? No. No? Okay, I was about to say if you do, I could. We could go to a roguelike dungeon and get you them. God damn it, it doesn't even let me make that! How the hell am I supposed to make a... Wait a minute. I know what I could do. What? Mm, nothing.
Oh, there it is. Okay. What? What do you mean, what? What are you doing? Well, I figured if I could get enough uh, mobs together that I could continually sacrifice. But is that working? Uh, well, it's producing a decent amount of blood, given the fact that I have the runes of augmented combat. No, wait, not the runes of augmented capacity. The runes of augmented sacrifice. So that gives you more blood each? Yes, more blood for each one's sacrifice, correct. Kind of note are you? A weird ass note. Just says ordoed. Our Phoenix just kind of like ran the fuck off. Okay, why is the grass so green here? What biome is this? This is it's a, a hooker it's biome. It's a plains biome. Well, the grass is so green here, and it, it looks like a magic forest almost. But without the forest. Hmm. Magical forest biome isn't really that green. And uh, they're a nice lush green of sorts. It, if anything, they're just considered green adjacent. Yep. Well, here's a village. Okay, now I have the magician's blood. Good for you. That now means you could actually make what you're wanting to. Yep. I'm kind of wanting to take one of these millionaire villages and just expand them. Hey, here's one right here. A meteor. So, what will this iron look like? I have no idea, but I know it's meteoric, which means it has to come from a meteor. I don't know if this is one you've done or not, though. Can't tell. It looks like it looks really, really small. This one. Does it have a hole? They all have holes in them. Oh my God! This takes longer than obsidian. Did you collect the ardite, by the way? Uh, Ardite? What yeah. Ardite? That you found in the nether? No. You didn't? Nope. Wish you would have. I absolutely wish that you would have. I really wish Aether 2 would have would have worked. That would have been a fun mod to have in here. Yeah, yeah, so I could take you up to the Aether, we could ride Moas all around, then when I get bored I can just push you off and watch you fall all the way down to the over. Don't you do that anyway? No, no. I do much worse. Uh, you try. No, I, I, yeah. much better. Much better than that, Charlie. You should know. Okay. So, after adding one of augmented capacity, uh, my altar is now up to 12,000. Okay. That means each rune of augmented capacity adds in 2,000. Which means if I make an entire row... My capacity for the blood altar should be more than enough. Yep. Just over at this meteor mining ore. Lots of granite here, apparently. Hmm. So, Charlie, as your publicist, how do you respond to your public about allegations that you pleasure yourself by rubbing sandpaper over your own nipples? Um, it's fun. It gives me that nice sting that I'm looking for all the time. It's almost like having sex with a hooker, but without the hooker. And the AIDS. Uh-huh. 
And what do you say to the United States government that plans to prosecute you for all of your unpaid taxes and all of the fact that you have been smuggling $10 million worth of Peruvian cocaine of your anus every year? Well, I want them to at least understand that that much cocaine really hurt and is really hard to get up there and is really hard to get past border control and the airlines and, uh, and, and I think you need to stop there because you have officially given confession <laughs> given what? confession Conf they can't prove it <laughs> well no confession's enough for them to convict anyone anyway um yeah. what's, the, what's the worst that's gonna happen the FBI's gonna come knocking at your door no, they're going to come knocking at your your house, you're confessing. Uh, all I got was knocking at your and then you cut out for a good second. Charlie, no, they're going to become knocking at your door because we're at your house and you're the one confessing. Yes, but you're the one and questioning me and knew all about it beforehand. Actually, I oh, fuck! No! Oh, screw that iron. Well, is you don't Charlie like getting, getting there, apparently. By weirdness? I'm getting erased by sand, if that counts. Hmm. I... I don't know what to say, Charlie. I think you need more sand than Uranus. Shmooly dong? Sure. Oh, time to hop back on the fucking Phoenix. I really don't want to fly off to sea, because if I fly off to sea, I will never find anything. I'll be flying for a long time before I find anything in the sea. Yep. I'm stuck. In the air. This phoenix has locked me in the air. But yeah, I could jump out of the phoenix with no problem. I failed to understand this phoenix. I'm actually getting awful tired of riding the phoenix. It is nice, but it absolutely does me no good. So I'm kind of wanting to fight the Gaia champion. Do a little mm. bit more Botania. Well, that just seems magical, Charlie. Just... Just magical. Well, I would need your help. No. There are so many obsidian totems here. Oh my yep. god, that's like four in one small area. And they're all eerie yep. biomes. Here's another node right here. It's not a bad node though. We have so many nodes here I've never I've never found. Didn't Cassie find a village that had a um a smeltery in it. Mm. Thought she did. Yours are kind of like Wizard Tower. Okay, the capacity for my altar is now 48,000. There's some kind of Wizard Tower over here. I can't. There's the door. I wonder what's it. Oh, it's a roguelike dungeon. Holy shit, this one looks cool. Alex, you would love this one. Just how it looks. Nah, I don't love any. But it looks like a fucking wizard tower. Well, I mean... I like, it doesn't... looks better than my original wizard tower one. What? Nothing. Okay. That's not a door. That's a window. I'm too stupid to realize that windows are not doors. Okay, then. So now that I have the Magician's Blood Orb, I should have the ability to make what I want. So, Master Ritual Stone. I need four, ri four Ritual Stones. You know all that time I, I normally spend looking for Aura Nodes and all that? Yeah. I now know the direction I need to go to find an Aura Node. What? Uh, the other direction that I don't ever go. There are so many aura nodes in this direction. So like a loser? 